wasn't like this. Some days I just can't seem to hit anything. Your mind, body, and technique are not synchronized. Find harmony between the three. You lack experience. You'll improve if you practice. Now that you mention it, Shamir, how come I've never seen you train? Do you keep odd hours? Or are you just so good that you don't even need it anymore? I am always training. Look here. A dagger. Watch. Oh. Oh, is she going to uh, bullseye the dagger? A... Wow, nice throw. That was a long one. But does throwing knives at pillars really count as shooting practice? Look closely. Is that... a centipede? You pierced it clean in half. How did you even see that? I train everything. Eyes, speed, accuracy. Watch as the bird flies. Feel the wind. Recognize the distance between objects. Not all training requires a weapon. Integrate training into your daily routine. My daily routine, huh? Well, that's great advice. Thanks. I'll do my best. Very good. Just be cautious. Hi. Okay. Huh. Well, time to do the normal thing, chat. Well, first off, let's take a look at, uh... Get... Anybody not want to... Oh, you're good. You can easily become a... Speed and deck player. Not like crazy. You lose three dexterity. You gain critical twenty. Where's your current crit? Well, okay then. I guess there is no way. Yeah, his strength goes up like crazy. His strength, yeah, his strength goes up nicely, but. Gotta work on our land skills. Oh, oh. Oh. 
Oh, it's her. Oh, Lance is her buddy. Alex. Lawrence can definitely be number two. Not working on that. Feel it. You're not quite there yet. You're at 69% for water. Oh, wow, you lose on a... I'm not paying to get it. <laughs> Sorry, Felix. You're not paying to get it. Done looking at everybody's stuff. There is some uh, look at. The new shield. Or a shield. A shield that grants divine protection from projectiles. Nullifies effectiveness against fire. <clears throat> uh, what? Uh, what? I'm actually going to give that to, uh... I'm just going to give that to you. Or, no. no. These 
already high enough. He's all, his speed is already pretty high. Enough. There you go. Attain some other stuff. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, ability. I give her this. She's just gonna create all. I just. And my bow initiates combat while well, using it. Italian endurance is less than one third. Grant. Oh, this is only a B. Oh, okay. So never mind. Never mind. Not great. Never mind, not great. Like how much crit? 35 crit plus the plus the 10 on top of it. And for more ability, that's 45 crit plus her dexterity. How do you figure crit? I gotta I gotta get the math on. I gotta figure this one out. about that. That's what I'm going for. I'm gonna sit. Okay. Here we go. <clears throat> Unit skill. Unit skill. What? Oh, 
Okay, that's fine. Can I get a last pin fusing? Never mind. Never mind. I, 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 I might have to look this up. Next hit rate and crit. Hmm. Oh. The next we go into combat, I'm gonna have to put in some uh put in a couple things with that. Alright, that's enough of that. Save, boom, boom, and is no ordinary knight. I will prey upon him. I will quench my blade's thirst with his blood. His focus is on fighting you, I'm sure. But mine will be the last face he sees. Masters. Um, let's get through talking with everybody first, and then we'll see how that goes. Here's an idea. Cornelia took control of the kingdom capital, and then founded the Fargus Dukedom in the Old Kingdom territory. Still, Fargus has remained a mere spectator with regard to our actions so far. It's not so surprising when you consider that they can't even get a handle on the Fraldarius territories. Huh. Oh. Really? Right. 
Well, oh, it, eh, Marianne. Professor, my, um, my mother might be in the city. I don't have many good memories of her, if I'm being honest, but she's dearer to me than my father. If you happen to see her, please make sure she's not caught up in all the fighting. She's only a civil servant, so hopefully she takes a cue from her Bernie and stays inside. <laughs> That's Bernie for you. If we can win this war, then Claude will be the king of Fodlan, and... Maybe he'll tear down the wall that separates Fodlan from the outside world. Oh, uh, hopefully. Perhaps I know it's hard to imagine. But I really hope he does. It would be so much better if people could live together instead of apart. I might even be able to live an ordinary life in the world Claude envisions. That Nardell guy, or Nadir, I suppose. It was all some trick, and we fell for it. <laughs> I don't think the nickname The Undefeated applies if he flees from us. Though, maybe he only got that name by running away. Can't be defeated if you run off, right? Ha! Ah, wait, wait, hold on, lady. First, you were saying that he was really handsome to you and had all the aspects right. you were looking for, and now you're saying that he's a coward and runs off all the time. You don't like him. Make up your mind, will ya? Make up your mind! <laughs> Rude! Rude! Again, the vegetable. Oh, I can do it right. Er, sure. 2,000 gold right there. Boom. In the opera, actors came and went all the time. But the people behind the scenes would stay forever. I'll bet I'd know a few of them now, even after all these years. They've probably left the capital by now. Although, I'm still worried about them. Weird if you weren't. Hey! Ooh. Oh, my crowd. Hey, what are you? Me? Huh? Just recently, the fish in the pond suddenly started thrashing Thanks. around like mad. I didn't know what was going on. And then I saw something gleaming in the southeastern sky. It happened right when you were out on campaign. I wonder what it could have been. Uh, something I hope that doesn't get caught. We're heading up to Embar next. I hope I make it back safe, so I can tell my little sis about it. I hear they got a neat opera house there, where Manuela used to perform. What was it called again? Middle front. Ha! <laughs> That's the one. Middle front. My little sis always goes on about how much she'd like to see him perform. I know we can't see a show, but do you think we could at least see the building? Me? Hey, Greetings, bro. Professor. Nothing to report. Momentum's really picking up for this final battle, huh? Even I'm starting to feel tense. Me! Enbar's history goes back 1,400 years. That even predates the founding of the Empire. It's one of the sacred sites of the Saros faith, so... It's a pretty big deal. But hey, no need to worry about the monastery while you're fighting the final battle. I've got it covered. I'll defend it to my last. I have the slightest feeling we're not exactly going to go there. Well, I'll be. Just a few months ago, I thought it was impossible to secure a victory against the Imperial Army. But you've shown me miracles can happen after all. I believe that victory is within your grasp. Welcome! Okay. 
I'm a speed user, or evasion. <coughs> yeah, speed user, yep, evasion. Aw, oh, got a speed. I think I might just give you a speed, uh, evasion. Oh, have another. the Alliance is making sure that the five great lords help with the effort, but we'll be getting support from the smaller territories too. I'll bet this is the first time those territories have worked so closely together, at least since the founding of the Alliance. Well, I actually don't doubt it. Ten years ago, Dagda and Bridget attacked the Empire from the west. Their final target was the capital. But they were countered at a port town long before they reached their destination. I guess our attempt has been more successful than theirs, all things considered. It looks like we're nearing the end of this struggle. No, we're not. We still I'm got sure Lady Rhea is in the hopes waiting for me to swoop in and rescue her. Probably. <laughs> I was just kidding. Pay me no mind. Lady Rhea's not waiting for me, I know. No matter how much I might wish she were. She's waiting for you. A little weird when you say that. Professor! Here's an idea. The Empire's army should be divided now, with significant troops still in the West. If they don't assert their authority over the Old Kingdom's lords, they'll never know when an uprising might start. Ironically, as soon as we capture the Imperial capital, the Old Kingdom's lords are likely to rise up immediately. Oh. I didn't realize that before. Okay. Professor? No. Okay then. Open up. Open up. Come on. Professor, professor. Oh. There are all kinds of rumors about you spreading through the Alliance. Some say you're the new embodiment of Saint Saros herself. Claude's popularity has certainly risen too. Somewhat. So, did you know, a magnificent canal flows through downtown Enbar. It's said to have been constructed under the guidance of Saint Seros before the Empire was even formed. Ever since, that canal has been a major lifeline for the capital's development. And now this is how the Empire repays it. Truly, no good deed goes unpunished. Now, in all honesty, I was considering just yes. going. Well, I was, I was taught just from a young age to believe that the creed of Saros was just the way of the world. To question it never even occurred to me. But Claude and Edelgard are different. They challenge the common wisdom, even defy it. It is uncomfortable to discard familiar assumptions, but that is an essential quality of the visionary. Indeed, true greatness must lie beyond common sense. Hmm. <laughs> That's good. I should write that down. Okay. Come to think the whole of the capital is going to be a battleground. The city has such a long heritage. Even so, 
Perhaps it deserves to be reduced to ashes for once. But we can't let the common folk get hurt. We should try to confine the damage to the noble section of town.